Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Omega HD, and today I'm bringing you your second installment in the 10.0 of every gun series. I, I'm actually loving it so far. It's been absolutely brilliant. I'm using guns I wouldn't normally use, as well as attachments. Um, it's, it's somewhat boosted the lifetime of Black Ops for me. So I probably would have left it alone in the next two weeks and gone on to play GoldenEye or Conduit 2. Or I'm going to start playing Xenoblade, which is the game which is about to come out. And uh, it's well, Xenoblade is very much like Monster Hunter. It's like a RPG, a sword fighting game, and it looks well. It's impressive to me. I think it looks amazing. But unfortunately, it only comes out in the PAL version. So you guys in the states won't be able to get it. It only comes out in Europe. So that's kind of a big bummer. So I'm not sure if I'll be posting too many videos of that, but I might post the taster one. And if you guys like that, I will content. Well, actually, post some more. But anyway, today I wanted to talk about my open lobby. My open lobby is going to be today at midnight Greenwich Mean Time. So midnight for me is 12 o'clock. Yes, and if you are on the East Coast, it'll be five hours behind that. So that'll be about eight o'clock. If you're on the West Coast, it'd be eight hours behind me, which will be five o'clock. So you can figure out where you are from there. Um, <laughs> I really don't can't be bothered, but that's it. So five o'clock east, well five o'clock West Coast, eight o'clock East Coast, and one hour plus, well one in the morning for everywhere else, everywhere else in Europe, and twelve at night for England. Okay. Well, gee, well Great Britain, yeah. Is that okay? We're gonna be doing some Mike Myers. We're gonna be doing some. Uh, I think we should do some scrims. I want to do some scrims. Uh, what else do I want to do? Well, you guys can tell me what you want to do. Yeah, so if you have a mic on, you'll probably be able to tell me. And also, just really, really quickly here, um, my gameplay is kind of messed up at the moment. Some of it speeds up and slows down in some places. It, it's, it's weird. The audio goes out of sync. I don't like it. I don't know what's going on, and I really need to fix it. So. Just bear with me. The next video is like it as well, and I've pretty much had to go and do. Well, I'm going to have to go and do the rest of them because it's become gradually worse and worse. So, Mac 11's next. Yay! I love the Mac 11. Unfortunately, it's not as, as good a score as this, which is 15.0, but it's a free for all. Free for all is just like the place to go when you can't get gameplay. It's just like it's full of lower levels. I'm not going to say noobs, I'm just going to say people with lower levels who could eventually become good players, but. You know, they're a bit slow. Yeah. Anyway, if you play free for all and you keep, if you maintain a really high kill, kill death, well, if you want to maintain a high kill death, I suggest free for all. It's full of bad players who are new to the game, so go ahead and do that. But I'm not a fan of it. I get bored of it quite easily, and I often feel the need to camp, and I never like feeling the need to camp. That's the only reason I don't play PS3. Or Xbox. I uh, I have a PS3. My kill death ratio is higher on it, but I always feel the need to camp. Whereas on the Wii, I can just run around and have fun, which is the best aspect of it. So yep, scorpions. What 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 are good about them? Um, uh, I can't I couldn't use them in any other way. I probably could have got dogs with them in by using them normally, but I don't think I could have had as much fun. Or well, actually, I couldn't have enjoyed them as much without having them in Akimbo. Having them in Akimbo just makes you feel like a complete badass. It's just like, <laughs> yes. And that, that actually links quite closely to what I wanted to talk about. I wanted to talk about how you should be able to, with the Wii Remote and non you should be, able to have, should be able to have your guns move independently. So, for instance, the non moves one gun, and the Wii Remote moves the other. And you shoot like that, so... You could be like firing at two people at once and getting kills from like two two different angles, which I think would be pretty damn amazing. That'd be a new step in gameplay and uh, technology for the Wii if they were actually to incorporate that into the game. So yeah, I I was pretty much about to finish 30 for one here, but you know, um, I just think get a bit big headed and think I could spray this guy down, get the plus 50, think he's dead and he's not. Stupid dogs. That is just one of the most annoying things. So yeah, guys, this has been Omega HD. Scorpions next. Open lobby tonight. My friend code will be in the description. I'll see you then.